right, all right, all right. Hey, YouTube, I'm Lucky, and this is your weekly Xur PSA video. I'm going to analyze all of his loot. We got legendary armor in here now as well, so keep that in mind. We got the Monte Carlo 600 RPM auto rifle, very strong, and does get your melee back. This can be really great for farming melee-oriented bounties in PvE, and in PvP, it's probably like, um, I'd say maybe A tier or maybe B tier around that area because the 600s are actually pretty strong. Uh, Liar's Handshake is a, a decent uh, hunter exotic gauntlet. Um, you can mess people up with that extra melee damage when they hit you with a melee. This stat roll is pretty trash, though. 59 is a little bit low. Uh, Helm of Saint 14, not a half bad distribution. 62 is a little bit on the lower side overall. You know, mid 60s is kind of what you'd be looking for generally from Zer and stuff. And then the next one, we've got a 63 stat Claws of a Hamakar with 20 recovery. This is actually really, really good for your Warlock. This is like exactly what you're looking for. Um, especially it also has 15 strength, which this is a double melee charge for whatever Warlock class you're using. So definitely a great roll of Claws of Hamakara. I'll grab, be grabbing that for my Warlock, and I would recommend you do the same. Is it S tier? Probably not quite, but it's close. It's, it's very close. Uh, we got a 7 Seraph Carbine, 450 RPM. Auto Rifle. Um, these aren't the best in PvP right now. This roll is not the worst ever, though. I get Range Finder's probably decent on it. Uh, and then the 7 Seraph Revolver. You, if you only, pretty much only want to use this if you get... Uh, payload on it. I uh, got a rangefinder last dance. This is actually probably pretty good. Um, this could probably shred in PvP. Might want to grab that. Uh, Timelines vertex with friendly planted demolitionists. Can skip that one. Shad long shadow with hip fire grip rampage. Definitely don't need to rock around hip firing a sniper, right? And then honor's edge. That's definitely not a god roll. You can skip that. And it's really cool that frozen orbits here. Triple tap vorpal is like one of the most sought after rolls of this weapon obviously this doesn't have it it's got surplus box breathing so it's not a god roll but cool to see that that weapon's there um now we've got the gauntlets we got 65 stat roll the distribution is kind of muddy just kind of even the 65 overall is a really high roll to just grab for free so keep that in mind this is a really good distribution right here uh, depending on what subclass you're using like if you're using um stasis hunter right now this is amazing this is really good uh definitely grab that if you need um Cloak is a cloak. Helmet is doo-doo. We got 58 stat. Don't really need that. And then 63 stat on the boots. Uh, with a high resilience distribution, not the best, honestly. So you could probably skip on that. So overall, the best thing to grab, probably this Claws of Ahamakara. Probably this Last Dance. And then this chest piece uh, is really, really good. That would be my selections from each column. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Make sure to subscribe. If you enjoyed, smash the like button. I'll see you in the next one. Later.